new video showing the moments a man attacked a woman while she was simply shopping at a Walmart. That suspect was arrested, but police believe there could be more victims out there somewhere. And Local 10 Sonella Sabovic is live in Miami with these troubling brand new details. Sonella, that video is just incredible to watch. Christy, it is disturbing and police believe there may be other victims because it was such a bold attack. It happened right inside of that store in public. Now, these Good Samaritans jumped in to help out and they helped police catch their guy. Get out! Cell phone videos rolling as Good Samaritans jump in to remove a man that was allegedly sexually assaulting a woman at a Northwest Miami Dade Walmart. <laughs> Two men tackle 28 year old Breeden Jarmal Harvey, place him in a chokehold, and hold him to the ground until police arrive. He was arrested not long after. And it was a frightening ordeal for the female victim. According to an arrest report, she was simply shopping when Harvey allegedly approached her from behind, pulled up her dress and touched her backside. When she turned around, police say he pushed her to the ground, ripping off her underwear while trying to touch her below the waist. It was then that the two witnesses saw what was happening and forcibly removed him off of the woman. Harvey, who was already out on probation when this happened, appeared in court where a judge granted him a $50,000 bond. He was ordered to stay away from the victim and the Walmart. And at the Walmart today, there was a police presence outside of the store, but shoppers are still feeling disturbed. It's a scary situation. I mean, I would, I feel sorry for the person that went through it, but unfortunately, that's like, I guess the world we're living in today. No normal human being would do that. It has to be something wrong with it. So again, police believe there may be other victims out there and they're urging them to call the Miami-Dade Sex Crimes Investigation Unit. Their number is 305-715-3300. That is the latest here from Northwest Miami-Dade. Sonella Sabovic, Local 10 News.